You dip the way you want to dip. I'll dip the way I want to dip. <laughs> Give me the chip! It's time to do your best Santa Claus impression and check this list twice, because here are the 10 best barbecue sauces in the grocery store. Let's put another shrimp on the barbie. Stubbs Original Barbecue Sauce. Tastes so good, make you want to slap your mama. Don't it, Willie? Yeah, boy. Chances are you've probably seen a row or two of Stubbs barbecue sauce aligning the shelves of your local grocery store. And you might have also noticed that the row has gotten wider over the years as Stubbs has continuously added new variations and flavors to their sauce family. But for the sake of this list, we are going back to the original Stubbs barbecue sauce, the one that started it all. No way! And this one makes the top 10 for a few reasons. The first is obviously the taste. If you find that bottled sauces are usually a little too much on the sweet side, this is definitely the bottle you should grab. They avoid the sweetness and instead opt for a more tomato and vinegar flavor profile, which hits your palate right off the bat. And for those of you sensitive to heat, this original flavor is not spicy. And while the taste is important, Stubbs also gains a few extra points for its ingredients. And if you still want Stubbs but prefer your barbecue flavors in a sauceless form, the company also also produces some good dry rubs. How them ribs? You know how they are. You know I like to hear them. Perfect. Rufus Teague Blazing Hot Sauce. Yeah, no, I'm fine. I always react this way to spicy food. While some of us are proud wimps when it comes to spicy foods, there are others who take great pride in their love for the hot stuff. You know who they are. Those people who actually do put that stuff on everything. George likes his chicken spicy. For those folks, may we suggest Rufus Teague's Blazing Hot Sauce? Getting its heat from Chipotle's and chili peppers, this Rufus Teague offering provides a very nice balance of both heat and flavor. One frequent problem with many hot sauces is that they forego the flavor in order to smack you with the spicy, but not here. In fact, while there is definitely a heat kick, it isn't as hot as the blazing hot name might suggest, meaning even some of us who avoid spicy foods might enjoy this sauce. Don't get us wrong, it is spicy, just not so much that it'll melt your taste buds. It's just the right amount. And if you want to try it, but don't want to get off your couch and go to the store, you can find bottles of the stuff on Amazon and have them delivered right to your door. And you're sure this is gonna work? Maybe order a few steaks online as well. Kingsford Original. Can you smell what's cooking? If you're thinking to yourself, isn't Kingsford the company that makes charcoal for the barbecue? Well, yes, they are. Not only do they make charcoal briquettes, but they are the largest producer of the product in the country. So while they may not be your typical food producer, they definitely understand the world of barbecue. Now would everyone please back off and just let me cook in peace? And while they've been around for over 100 years, they didn't decide to produce a barbecue sauce until just a few years back, coming out with Kingsford Original in 2017. As you might have guessed, given the history behind the company, they decided to go with a pretty traditional flavor with their first barbecue sauce release, a classic smoked hickory sauce that works great as a marinade as well. However, while they aren't reinventing the wheel here, they are doing classic flavors and doing them well. It's nice to see such a big company also using good ingredients. They use real hickory smoke and brown sugar to get the flavor they want, whereas many other brands in the same price range use artificial flavors. It's all a fugazi. You know what fugazi is? That's a big difference, and one that allows Kingsford Original Barbecue Sauce to stand out from the crowded, mid-tier range of sauces that fill grocery store shelves. KC Masterpiece Original. I need the real stuff. KC Masterpiece. Or you just ain't eating barbecue. As many of you know, barbecue is a very regional thing in the United States. From California to Texas to Tennessee, every region has its own taste profile, style, and sauce type. And one of the most popular around is the one from Kansas City. Known for its thicker sauce, it's usually a tomato-based variety with a little sweetness to it. And it is in that tradition that the KC Masterpiece original lives. 
a lie! It's a lie! This is a mass-produced sauce that you can probably find anywhere throughout the country. And while mass-produced can often mean a lesser quality, that sure isn't the case here. The folks at KC Masterpiece Original use quality ingredients and a kettle cooking technique to produce a flavorful product. It isn't hard to see why this one is so popular with everyone who tries it. Baked, broiled, or grilled, KC Masterpiece Original is a great choice for all of your meat cooking needs. And it won't break the bank, either. Now you can call it barbecue. KC Masterpiece, the sauce that makes it barbecue. That is one of the benefits of mass production, being able to offer the product at a lower cost to consumers. A good sauce at a good price? What more could you ask for? So if you haven't yet tried this iconic brand, what are you waiting for? King's Hawaiian Smoked Bacon Barbecue Sauce. Stop double dipping! When it comes to the flavor of barbecue sauces, we usually discuss things in terms of sweetness and or the prevalence of vinegar. Those are two of the main aspects that tend to differentiate one sauce from another. But with King's Hawaiian Smoked Bacon Barbecue Sauce, it's the bacon that makes it stand out from the crowd. Yes, bacon. They say everything is better with bacon, and King's Hawaiian took that to mean barbecue sauce as well. And who are we to argue with that? Given how popular bacon is, it's more surprising to see how more barbecue barbecue sauces haven't gone down this path yet. I want bacon! But nevertheless, we're more than happy that King's Hawaiian did it. The strong pork flavor is definitely an original take and might catch a few people off guard at first, but rest assured, it all ties together. Unless you don't like pork, then maybe steer clear of this one. Otherwise, you definitely need to give this sauce a try. When it comes to food, the term Hawaiian can be a little controversial, as in Hawaiian pizza and the belief by some that pineapple should never be put on a pizza. And there might be some folks who feel that way about bacon in a barbecue sauce. I gotta tell you something. Bacon is good for me. But if using bacon on or in anything is breaking the rules, then those are the rules we want to break. Dinosaur Barbecue Sensuous Slathering Sauce. Hey, Bon, you like your steak rare? Yeah. That one's yours. While this one is a little harder to find in your everyday grocery store than many of the others on this list, that doesn't mean that, like the dinosaurs themselves, it's gone extinct. You don't need to go on an archaeological dig to find it either, just to search through the shelves of a few local grocery stores. And when you do come across it, it is worth grabbing and putting in your cart because this is a yummy sauce that is well worth the price. Shut up and take my money! Plus, more good news, it's one of the least expensive bottles of quality barbecue sauce out there. As for the flavor profile, this sauce is rocking some of the lowest sugar of any other bottle on the list, and yet it still brings the perfect amount of sweetness to the table, mostly from the use of ingredients such as bell peppers. Add a little tangy and smoky, and your taste buds are going to be very happy. And so will your meat, as this sauce comes with a nice consistency that makes it ready to baste right out of the bottle. No additives needed. And speaking of additives, the full list of ingredients is a very natural, friendly one, which, unlike many actual dinosaur names, you can actually pronounce and recognize every ingredient. You're right. I mean, what is a Pianitskisaurus anyway? Sweet Baby Ray's Barbecue Sauce. Sweet Baby Jesus! This is another classic sauce that you should probably have no trouble finding at your local grocery store. And while it may not be gourmet, or produced in small batches in a hipster smokehouse, there is a reason that Sweet Baby Ray's is so popular, because it is really good. It has a nice smokiness, great flavor, and the texture is just right for all your barbecue needs. And the price point is great as well. Whether you get it at the grocery store, on Amazon, at Walmart, etc., this sauce has a lot of fans. I have to order something really cool. A quick online search will get you multiple hits for homemade sauce recipes that claim to be copycats and just like Sweet Baby Ray's. You know something is good when people are trying to come up with ways to make a knockoff. Show of hands, who here has tried at least once to find a knockoff Big Mac sauce recipe online? Exactly. And while Sweet Baby Ray's original sauce is probably the most popular, the company has a whole line of sauces you can try. Flavors like teriyaki, honey mustard dipping sauce, and even buffalo wing sauce, which sounds like the perfect option for your next Super Bowl party. Breaded wings? 
You're blowing it, bro. The stuff comes in a squeeze bottle, and the packaging isn't anything that stands out, so it could easily get lost in the shuffle if you hadn't tried it before. But don't ignore it. Grab a bottle on your next grocery run. You won't be disappointed. And also, it's kind of fun to say, sweet baby Ray's. Bone Suckin' Sauce. Bone Suckin' Sauce is the sauce for me. Not only is it a great barbecue sauce, but bone sucking sauce is also a great name, albeit ripe with double entendre potential. We'll keep things PG, though, as we tell you about this yummy jar of awesome sauce. The sweetness level of a barbecue sauce is one of the most important flavor factors that people consider. While some like a sweet sauce, there are others who rail against it. It really depends on what region you are from and where your barbecue allegiance lies. We say all this because this bone sucking sauce has definitely got a stronger sweetness to it than most of the others on this list. Eat like a man. In fact, we've seen it described as leaning more towards a sweet and sour sauce in terms of its taste. And is that a bad thing? Let's face it, sweet and sour sauce is pretty great. Now, take that sweet and sour profile and throw in some nice hickory smoke, and you've got something kind of awesome, bone-sucking goodness. For those used to a sicker Kansas City-style sauce, this one might be a bit on the liquidy side as far as its rib-sticking ability is concerned. But if you're willing to do a little cooking, a few minutes on the stove will be plenty enough to thicken it right up and make it ready to slather all over over your evening meal. J1 Korean Bulgogi and Kalbi. Chinese noodles with Korean barbecue. What's wrong? And a taco. While the rest of this list focuses its attention on classic American barbecue, we couldn't leave out this delicious Korean style barbecue sauce. If you've never experienced a Korean barbecue, then you need to get yourself to the closest restaurant and order up a few of their signature dishes because it is a cuisine that you need to try. You know that Korean barbecue joint down the street, Mr. Kim's? For those of you who have had the pleasure and want to bring some of that flavor back home to your kitchen, a great option is J1 Korean Bulgogi and Kalbi. The sauce brings together a wonderful list of ingredients, including the likes of brown sugar, soy sauce, garlic, ginger, pepper, Asian pear, and sesame oil. The sauce is a perfect combination of salty and sweet, and the thickness is perfect for marinades or to brush it right onto your meat. This bottle is a must-have in your fridge for those times you want to change things up up and experience a different flavor profile. It's the perfect way to bring the Korean restaurant experience to your dining room table. Right on the street is that it's delicious and powerful. Whether it's on beef or pork, this sauce is a tasty choice. But the real deal would be to use it in some traditional Korean recipes, like bulgogi or kalbi, to get the full experience. You could even throw it on some veggies if you're feeling really adventurous. Barbecue sauce of all kinds isn't just for meat anymore. Drunk fruit barbecue. Barbecue sauce. It'll get you drunk! Looking for something a little different from your regular barbecue sauce? Well, then you will definitely want to get your hands on a bottle of drunk fruit barbecue sauce. Instead of getting sweetness from more typical ingredients like sugar, molasses, or honey, the drunk fruit sauce uses, you guessed it, fruit. It might sound a little out of the ordinary, but oh, how it works. And in case you were wondering about the drunk part of the name, each of the sauces also throws in a little bit of booze to complete the flavor profile. The company produces three sauces. Bourbon cherry, blueberry rum, and peach tequila. All very distinct and all very delicious. How do you like your ribs? You can taste each part of them. The fruit, the liquor, and the barbecue sauce are all prominent and present. There are even tiny bits of pieces of fruit that add a little something and are neither too sweet nor too savory. They're just right. Trying all three is highly recommended. And while we know that this list is about grocery store sauces, these bottles are currently only available online at Uncommon Goods. But we thought these were extra special to deserve mentioning anyway. Let's get out this door, Rummy, and you're the city's problem. If you make it through the night, you're welcome back. We've got more. Just tap or click for another great video. Hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to join our notification squad.